Hi friends, welcome back to the channel, SciTech. In this video, I'm going to talk about the default graphic settings in the Call of Duty Mobile in the Icon EOS 7 Pro with the Snapdragon 8 Play Zone & Processor. So this is a Snapdragon 8 Play Zone & Processor and is a Call of Duty Mobile game. And right now I'm going to uh, show you whether the Call of Duty game supports what kind of FPS. So is a 90 FPS enabled on 120 FPS. All of these details I'll try to discuss in this video on the Icon EOS 7 Pro. So let's get started with this kind of uh, testing in this device and we'll try to find out the default graphic settings as well so what is the maximum you can play with a snapdragon 8 plus gen 1 processor so let me to go to the quickly the settings option and show you the graphic settings so right now we do have the option of the ultra fps but which will be supported with the low graphic settings and maximum with the medium maximum with the high you can use maximum and very high also you can use but right now i did select the ultra and the low quality and just to check so whether we are getting what kind of fps as well so let's go to the multiplayer and start the match and this is the real time uh, refresh rate and this might give the clear idea like uh, what is the refresh rate the game is actually playing with 90 or 120 hertz so this is not the fps this is only the refresh rate so just to give the basic idea i am trying to use this refresh rate option because there is no real time fps enabled in this ui So right now as you can see friends the game has been started and we are getting 120 hertz as well at this moment so which feels pretty good and there is also game frame interpolation option so if i try to turn off this game frame interpolation right now it's maintaining only 90 so as you can see friends it's maintaining 90 so which also pretty smooth no issues but uh, if i try to enable the game frame interpolation it will try to boost to 120 hertz so as you can see 120 so if there is any kind of uh, fps meter it will be really helpful but in this ui it is not there so i was unable to show you that but this might give some clarity as well to the users but haptic feedback is also working excellent uh, in this call of duty game no issues with the haptic feedback in this icon EOS 7 pro So meanwhile in case if you have any questions let me know in the comment section below friends and also don't forget to check the links in description for more videos on the Iconio 7 Pro. So all the links will be available in the description below regarding this device. So meanwhile signing off friends thank you for watching until next day for more updates and bye.